My name is Khaled Mojadidi, and I will be talking about her manuscript, Visual Migraine Aura, With or Without Headache, Association with Right to Left Shunt, an Assessment Following Transcutaneous Closure. Migraine is an episodic disorder with the cardinal symptom of severe headache associated with nausea and photosensitivity. It is one of the most common complaints encountered by neurologists. About 25% of people with migraine experience prodromal symptoms called migraine aura. The most common type of aura is visual, occurring in over 95% of people who have auras. These visual auras are characterized by shimmering or scintillating bright spots, C-shaped tears, zigzag lines, or a transient small area of visual loss. The headache usually appears between 5 to 60 minutes after the visual aura. A small subset of patients experience visual aura as an isolated symptom, unaccompanied by any headache. The first occurrence of this phenomenon can be alarming for some patients. The fear of losing their eyesight drives them to seek an ophthalmologist's help. However, the extensive workup for retinal disease is usually found to be negative in these patients. Our manuscript describes the association between symptoms of visual aura, both with and without headache, with the presence of Peyton Foreman of Valley. Peyton Foreman of Valley, also known as PFO, is a remnant of the fetal circulation at the level of the fossa ovalis. It persists in 20% of the general population and has been implicated in several medical conditions, such as cryptogenic stroke due to paradoxical embolism and migraine headache, especially migraines associated with auras. This paper demonstrates the impact of Peyton Foreman of Valley closure on symptoms of visual aura associated with or without headache. It presents another view on the problem of new onset visual aura without migraine headache and emphasizes that these may have a cause which is not based in the eye. 